The Brandenburg Gate is a neoclassical monument that has stood through the city's history since the 18th century and it should be at the top of your list of things to see in Berlin. The gate is a symbol of separation between East and West Berlin, and is probably one of the most significant landmarks in the city. Be sure not to miss this historical spot and the photo opportunities it brings. Located in the middle of the Spree River, Museum Island, also known as Museumsinsel, is a complex that was awarded UNESCO World Heritage Site status. If you are wondering about the best way to get your Museum Island tickets, it's best to purchase a three-day museum pass and spend a whole day there in order to fully appreciate the beauty of the place. Pergamon Museum, one of the most visited museums in Europe. You will find the Ishtar Gate, the Processional Way, the Market Gate of Miletus, and Islamic art there, among other things. Bode Museum, go there to see impressive sculptures, Byzantine and antique art. Noyes Museum, this one is great if you are interested in ancient Egyptian art. Altus Museum, for fans of Greek, Etruscan and Roman art. Alta National Gallery, a national art gallery with neoclassical, romantic, impressionist and early modernist artwork. Berlin TV Tower, also known as Fernström Berlin, gives the best 360-degree view of Berlin. It can hardly go unnoticed as it is the highest building in the city. Climb up this concrete jungle during sunset for a more scenic experience. As with most of the TV towers around the world, you can have cocktails or dinner at the Berlin TV Tower restaurant, which is a revolving one. Another historical site to visit in Berlin is the Reichstag, a place where the parliament sits. It has a glass dome which represents the political transparency of the city. The entrance to Reichstag Berlin is free of charge, but be sure to book your visit well in advance. If you would prefer to take a private tour instead of Reichstag in the glass dome, where a guide will explain everything you need to know without having to be in a big group of people, you can book yours here and you can choose to have it in your preferred language, English, French, Spanish or Italian. Berliner Dom, otherwise known as the Berlin Cathedral, is a neo-Renaissance-style building built in 1905. Paying a visit to this gorgeous cathedral is considered to be one of the top 10 things to do in Berlin. The dome is located right on Museum Island where numerous other museums are nestled. East Side Gallery is a 1,316-meter-long gallery where 105 paintings by artists from all over the globe can be found. Take a walk around this memorial of freedom and learn Berlin's history through it. There are other pieces of the wall that remain untouched, so you can see how it looked before, but this one section of the wall is a gallery, a place where artists can express themselves on the topic.
The Holocaust Memorial in Berlin is a memorial to the murdered Jews of Europe. The memorial is an open space structure and you can freely walk around it. Checkpoint Charlie was one of the most famous crossing points between West and East Germany back in the day. Now it is a tourist spot that boasts of double tap worthy sightings and taking a picture at Checkpoint Charlie is definitely a must do in Berlin. The place was even revamped in order to make it look exactly as it did during the Cold War. Well, you are in the right place, Berlin is well known for its crazy nightlife. Berlin has some of the best nightclubs in the world that you surely don't want to miss if you are a party animal. Berkheim, this is one of the most famous Berlin clubs and one of the best known in Europe. Berlin has endless flea markets because Berliners love them. One of the most popular flea markets takes place every Sunday and is located at Mauer Park. There you can find all sorts of vintage stuff ranging from clothes, shoes and bags to jewelry, furniture, bikes, vinyl records, and much more. This is definitely shopping heaven. <laughs> 